The Scarborough Hospital is one of Canada's largest community hospitals. From two general hospitals and six community-based sites, we serve over 600,000 residents who comprise one of Canada's most culturally diverse communities. Each year, we handle over 100,000 emergency department cases and over 700,000 outpatient and clinic visits. The hospital has faced significant challenges during the past decade. But today is a new day. Today, we share a much brighter outlook thanks to the tireless efforts of hundreds of people at every level of our organization. People who share a willingness to change and improve. Thanks to a comprehensive planning process that included more than 1,000 staff, physicians, volunteers and community members, we now have a roadmap to guide us forward through the next five years. That plan is based on new statements of mission, vision and values. These statements are the cornerstones on which we will build our future successes. Our new mission is uh, focused on our community and it means that uh, we have to pay attention to the needs of our patients and their families, ensure that they get an outstanding experience at the Scarborough Hospital. We're seeing families that come from all parts of the world. Each of those families has their own expectations about what they expect from the healthcare team. Some patients are just grateful to have a roof over their hospital and uh, you can see that uh, when they see some of our surroundings they're quite impressed with what we're able to give them. The vision is what this hospital is to be five years from now, ten years from now. And what it says is we want to be recognized as Canada's leader in providing the best health care to our global community. We can do that. Uh, the compassion and the caring and the cultural sensitivity I see every day is moving and extraordinary. But what we want to do is be recognized throughout the country and all of North America for having done this. So when you talk about values, five elements on its own are strong elements, but when put together as five fingers of a hand, when you respect people, you respect diversity, you take accountability for your action. If you don't have personal integrity, you're not going to respect others. These five values have to come together for us to deliver excellent care here at TSH. For me, the most important value is compassion. When we show and demonstrate compassion to our patients, then all the other values will follow. When we demonstrate respect and accountability, we automatically have integrity. They're all linked together. How can you have integrity without having respect or being accountable for something if you don't care? With regards to accountability, if you were to look around the building on a daily basis and come into a patient room, you'll see things such as heating, air conditioning, lighting. Every request that comes down from a nursing unit, from a department, they don't have to worry that that job is lost. They can spend time doing other things. They can go and they can do bedside care with the patients. The mission vision value is the key piece in who we are on the path to becoming the best community hospital. We want it to be a living, breathing document so that it's embraced by all of our staff. When a, a newborn comes into our nursery, it's a, a happy event for this family, but it can also be stressful when their infant is premature or sick. In the neonatal intensive care unit, the care that we provide is individualized to meet the physical, the developmental, the spiritual and the cultural needs of the family. I think actually the eye center is, uh, is almost like the results of the vision and the leadership. We actually become a very, very successful center. We do the same amount of the cases as some of the very large clinic, but they have the double or triple the amount of physicians as we do. We've implemented a lot of new policies, procedures, we've adapted new behaviors. The staff in the department has taken their own initiative to expand, to attend conferences, to go to courses. What we like to do at the hospital is we like to develop staff from within through training, through skills development, into other positions and to enhance their skills and bring them up professionally and promote them within the organization. I think we are going to be much more competitive. We can hire and retain the best people to, to provide the best service for our community. I feel the Scarborough Hospital is my hospital. Everybody from uh, my family come here. Uh, there are a lot of visible minorities. We have uh, signs in, in a lot of different languages. Having a patient relations person to listen to them and to address their concerns really make patients and families feel like they've been heard. Some people just need somebody to talk to, or they need to be reassured, or they need a little help. 
We don't just stand there and say it's down the hall. We make sure that they're comfortable with where they're going and it does make their day a little bit easier, I think. When we go to patients, we know that which language this patient is speaking and we are also able to understand the socio-cultural background which they are coming from because we are coming from the same background. People are very happy with the care we provide here simply because we respect their culture, their language and I have had many patients telling me that it feels like home. The mission, vision and values cannot be chapters of a book. It has to be something that's succinct, something that's sustainable, something that speaks to the accountability of um, you know the hospital staff to their patients and it has to be something that can be easily remembered by people this is why we're here we're here because we're proud to be here we're here because we're proud to serve and to do the perfect job <laughs>